What is going on guys, it's your boy, Big Dylan, back at it again, with another weapon review. And in today's review, we're going to be taking a look at the Raid Auto Rifle, called the Genesis Chain. Let's get into its perks. We have Whirlwind's Curse, this weapon does bonus damage against fallen enemies, and bonus agility when this weapon is equipped. For sights, we have Linear Compensator, Accurized Ballistics, and Field Choke. I'm going to be using Linear Compensator. For the first perk, we have Focused Fire. When zoomed, this weapon fires slower, but causes additional damage. Down the middle, we have Speed Reload. Reload this weapon very quickly. High caliber rounds, oversized rounds built to stagger targets and leave them reeling. And for the last one, we have Hammer Forged. Improved range and accuracy. I'm going to be using high caliber rounds, so it stuns enemies in PvP and makes people flinch in PvP. For the last perk, we have Focused Firefly. While Focused Fire is active, precision kills cause the target to explode. Very nice perk indeed. Now let's take a look at the weapon in all its glory, and let's get into some gameplay. Now let's get into the PvE side of things, starting with the strengths of the weapon. Firefly is probably the best perk to have on a primary weapon in PvE, in my opinion. Being able to clear trash ads like Thrall and Dregs is very, very useful. I can see this weapon being very useful in the Death Zamboni encounter within the new raid. Also, the recoil is very easy to control. I didn't find myself struggling to control the weapon at any point I used this weapon. Also, the base reload speed of the weapon is very good, so you don't need um, the auto rifle reload speed gauntlets. Now, the dislikes of the weapon for me would have to be the low carried ammo capacity. I always found myself running around for primary ammo. Also, the poor range of the weapon. Obviously, it doesn't have the flexibility of something like a scout rifle would in PvE. And also, the low damage output. With it being a high impact auto rifle, they're not particularly good right now in Destiny. Now, let's get into the PvP gameplay. Now, for PvP, I went into this thinking this weapon was going to be absolutely terrible with it being a high impact auto rifle. Um, but the weapon really did surprise me. Um, it's decent, but not top tier. Um, the kill time on the weapon is average. Um, it's not going to outkill a top tier weapon, something like the Ice Luna, the Lord High Fixer, or the Crucible Vendor Hand Cannon right now is very good also. High rate of fire pulse rifle, even a higher rate of fire auto rifle would be better than this. Um, would I recommend using this weapon in PvP? Personally, no, but it is fun to use. It's just, it lacks the damage that other weapons can output. Um, but all in all guys, it's a very good weapon, definitely worth the grind of the raid to get this. Um, I've had a lot of fun using it, and for now I'm just going to leave you with a couple of minutes of raw PvE gameplay. Hope you enjoyed the video, like, subscribe, and more videos coming soon. Peace. Heads up, the fallen are up to something. Heads up, we're not done yet.
almost through this. Keep fighting. I think we made our point. 